Hello everyone, welcome to Vinod Ratinam Tutorials. In this video, we are going to learn about NumPy indexing. We have already learned these concepts in the Python basics. Same thing, we will cover it once again for numerical Python. And a very important note, items in the NumPy array are n-dimensional array object follows zero based index. And it has three types of indexing field access basic slicing and advanced indexing first we will see how to access the array as usual import numpy as np the first step we have to import the library i am trying to create an array for range 10 so we have created a numpy array for the range 10 that is from 0 to 9 value from this numpy array now we have to access an element for example we want to access number 5 updated the output message so numpy array it will display like this now element at the mentioned index an output message a because the a variable we have saved the array within the square bracket you have to mention the index number i'm going to mention number five just executed so the element at mentioned index is five now we will see one more example in this example we will add the end and step parameter or attributes b equal to np dot a range I'm creating a numpy array from 10 to 30 series with step 2 print b from 10 to 30 with step 2 the numpy array is created just updated the output message numpy array is b then now we'll try to access using index number so b square bracket mention the index number let me mention 5 5 means 0 1 2 3 4 5 number 20 needs to be printed just execute 20 is printed so the first and second example are almost similar in the first example the range function is used with starting parameter in the second example start end and step all the three are included one more example and this example for accessing from the multi-dimensional arrays print c so we created a multi-dimensional array with two rows three columns two into three matrix now one important note whenever we handle with multi-dimensional arrays the index starts with zero it means this is the one two three belongs to zero row 4, 5, 6 belong to first row, 1 and 4 belongs to 0th column, 2 and 5 belongs to 1st column, 3 and 6 belongs to 2nd column. Keeping that in mind, I am going to access elements using row comma column index. Print C variable within square bracket. I want to access number 1, so 0 comma 0, just run number 1 print c can you guess for number 3 it is 0 comma 0 1 2 second column execute number 3 we can able to access it one more execution let's try to access number 5 0 row first row so 1 comma 0 column first column 1 so when you execute 1 comma 1 number 5 is retrieved this is how we have to handle the multi-dimensional arrays we have learned how to access the elements now we will try to assign or update the value inside the numpy array it is exactly similar like uh, basics python same example c so this is the c matrix now let's try to update the first value you know what is the index of first value 0 comma 0 so c square bracket 0 comma 0 equal to 10 
print c execute now number 10 has been updated from 1 same way this time number 6 we will take so c within the square bracket 1 comma 2 equal to some value 25 now we will print and see the value of 6 has been updated to number 25 this is how we have to update the values either in the single dimension or multi-dimensional array hope you got a clear picture how to access the element and also how to update the values in the numpy array so i'll be mentioning the url in the video description for materials you can refer each examples which i already posted in this website that's the end of this video thanks for watching happy learning